Sport is great, but, but it's quite a selfish thing to do. Uh, this is completely different. And you feel that sense of um, responsibility every day when you walk in through the front entrance. People out there might just think we are made up of, of elderly people, and that isn't the case. When people ask me, how did I get into the House of Lords? I said, by lying, cheating, and stealing. I ended up in the prison system, so I became highly skilled and educated by the British prison system. So you are able to get a big group of expert people entering politics who may otherwise you know, never have considered that career. And I think that's incredibly important for our democracy. Difficult subjects like mental health, drug and alcohol are dealt with better. We're there for a long time, we get to know our subject areas, we get to know the people within them, and people come and talk to us. We have an obligation to speak uh, on behalf of those who don't have a voice. I think it's the ability to make a difference, to influence government policy or to influence legislation. I'm Welsh, I'm a mum, I live in the north of England, I'm a Paralympian, uh, you know, I'm, I'm a bit like a Venn diagram. We have to bring all those things uh, to the chamber. We have people from 28 different religious backgrounds, different walks of life, um, privately educated, a lot of state educated, a lot of disabled people. House of Lords is anything. It's an increasing place where race, culture, uh, social identity is also being questioned and there are more people who correspond to where I come from. It can't be good to make legislation for a whole country if the people doing it all come from a very similar background. The Life Peerages Act has meant that uh, a different group of people are able, in a very positive way, to come together, to contribute to political life, to bring together all their knowledge, their experience, their lived life, uh, and, and are able to make a positive difference to legislation. Uh, the introduction of the Life Peerages Act had many, many um, implications, say, getting uh, women into the House of Lords, getting uh, a more diverse set of peoples with backgrounds. Hitherto, it had all been aristocrats. And the fact that there are women who've been and are in senior positions here as government ministers or shadow ministers is, is very important. Uh, it, it's a sign that the Lord is able to move pretty quickly in the direction we should. I honestly do think that the inclusion of women and in the last 20 years in the House of Lords, it, it has really accelerated, has really shown what a force for good equalities legislation can be.